Hey guys, Morgan Wright Builder here again. Uh, today we will be doing the unboxing for the MS06S Zaku 2, uh, piloted by Shar Aznable. Uh, this will be my first Zaku frame, I guess is the best way to put it. Uh, I've built a couple other no grade mono eyes. This will be my first master grade mono eye for sure. Uh, looking forward to the build, so let's get into the unboxing for it. So, as usual, uh, one of the first things in is a set of decals. We've got, looks like, some stick-ons and looks like some dry transfers, which is good. I like those, so they usually look really good when you're done. Uh, next up, looks like we've got... Uh, all of the curved pieces for the face, the waist, and the legs. So those should be fun. It'll be my first time tackling those. Uh, next out, we've got, looks like clear pieces, some uh, detail pieces for the knees, uh, most of the dark red armor pieces, and it looks like a couple of clear pieces used for the mono eye and I don't know what else. Next out is going to be all inner frame pieces. Shoulders, legs, backpack, waist, stuff like that. Next one up is going to be, looks like, some more inner frame. Uh, looks like the hip area. Maybe front and back of the waist. A uh, bunch of other stuff for that. Move on to the next riser. Looks like this one's got weapons parts, including the Heat Hawk, which uh, should be interesting. Uh, it'll be my first kit with a Heat Hawk, though it looks like it's pretty much already put together. So uh, next up looks like. Uh, about uh, the underside piece for one of the shoulders, more internal framing. Uh, it looks like that's probably about it. Looks like fingers for the hands, at least some of the parts for the hands. Next out, we're gonna get the small riser, the bright red for looks like probably the backpack. I'm guessing. Yeah, it looks like the backpack. So. It's that at some point, uh, your typical joint riser, so all your P, PC, whatever P they decide to name it for that set. Uh, some of the lighter red, aka definitely looks pink. Uh, parts for the armor, uh, looks like along with the fin for the head, and it looks like they actually may have given me two of them, which is kind of a nice thing. Unless I'm missing one somewhere else on the model, which is always possible as well. Uh, another riser full of pink pieces. Looks like more outside armor, legs, maybe a little bit of arms. Another set of pink. Looks like outside armor, arms more than anything. Maybe the backings for the hands and the wrists. Uh, two springs. Not sure where those go yet, but that'll be interesting. I've never used a spring in a kit before. Uh, another riser full of pink pieces, so more outside armor, knees, legs, feet, whatever they are. And the last one in the box will be, looks like the rest of the framework for the legs, uh, and the rest of the internal. So, got that. And then, as usual, all the way at the bottom of the box, get the direction manual. As usual, some basics about the model in a language that I can't read. Uh, looks like along with an entire listing of the different Zaku models. Uh, riser list along with anything you won't use being marked X. Uh, setup kind of giving you a few of the basic directions on how to apply the decals, what to cut, where to cut, uh, the entire layout of what comes in the kits, 
Then moving into, hey, build the kits, hey, build the kits. Nice big uh, color centerfold with the painting options, some posing options. Uh, good way of looking at some of it. It's kind of neat. More into building and more building. Um, looks like there's the springs down here, so they'll get used. It's like on the legs. Uh, more building. That's kind of new. There's a fold out. Um, then building the little lift truck that comes with it. Finishing off. The entire decaling page and just a nice standing back cover so hopefully I'll uh, get into the model pretty quick and be getting a completion review sometime soon I'm not sure I may do a uh, may do a review of uh, another kit before I get into the completion review on this one just something I've already built but uh, we'll see where it goes and until next time uh, if you haven't clicked the subscribe button, please do if you have. Thanks for watching. Uh, and Morgan Rape Builder, checking out.